on. The Eagles defense will be going up against an inexperienced Buffalo Bills offense. Uh, they'll be led by uh, rookie quarterback Trent Edwards, who's done a pretty good job for the Bills. Uh, after all, the Bills uh, a couple weeks ago had a chance uh, to get into the playoffs in the AFC, which is, uh, is nothing to sneeze about. And uh, they've got some good football players. Uh, Marshawn Lynch is a good young running back. Uh, he's got power. Uh, he has uh, some good size, and he's got good speed. Uh, he still needs to learn quite a bit uh, in the league, uh, but you can expect that he's going to touch the ball quite a bit uh, for the Bills because uh, they like uh, to try to hang on to the ball. Uh, one of the things with the Bills is that uh, they don't really have much of a passing game. They don't want to put too much pressure on Trent Edwards, so they would like to give the ball to Marshawn Lynch and let him uh, try uh, to dominate the game on the ground. Uh, I don't think they'll have a lot of success against the Eagles because their run defense has been much improved this year. Uh, so I expect them to be able to keep Marshawn Lynch uh, uh, under control, and that will be the key. Uh, they want to try to limit his yardage on first and second down. Uh, I wouldn't even be surprised if the Bills try to throw some on first and second down because uh, they want to keep the pressure off Edwards. If the Eagles can get Trent Edwards and that Buffalo Bills offense in third and long, they can go after them because uh, Trent Edwards has not seen all of the blitzes that Jim Johnson will uh, come at him with. And they're going to come from all different types of sides. I like the fact that the Eagles have a lot of uh, guys who have the ability to be versatile. They can rush the passer and they can drop for the pass. And you Bill Belichick, uh, Rex Ryan down in, in Baltimore, they've done a great job of using those quote unquote tweeners to create all kind of indecision on the offense. And you even saw the Jets do that to the New England Patriots and create problems for Tom Brady. Uh, you've got guys who can drop, guys who can rush the passer, and that are inter interchangeable. And the Eagles have a bevy of players like that. And I'd like to see them employ it more uh, because it keeps defenses, I mean, keeps the offense off balance. Now, the thing that concerns me about this game is Lee Evans, number 83. Uh, for the Buffalo Bills. This guy can get deep. He is a burner. Uh, he can run with the best of them. If the Eagles make a mistake on any plays, in fact, you can have this guy covered and he just flat out outruns who's ever covering him and runs down the football. He is that fast. Uh, he's a burner. He's the kind of guy the Eagles could use. A deep speed guy like this. And that's the guy that could change the game. If he were to get deep early, he could keep the Buffalo Bills in the game. He could put some points on the board. They've got to keep a safety deep on him, and you've got to give this guy room. He can run. Now, he might be able to run some comeback routes if they have enough time uh, to let him stretch the field and then come back. The Eagles have to honor his deep speed, and that play will be open uh, for the Bills. But they cannot let this guy get deep. That's the only way the Bills stay in this game is if they get deep on him. Now, uh, they have an all-pro uh, left tackle, Jason Peters, uh, for the Buffalo Bills. He will be matched up against Trent Cole. Now, Peters is having problems with the groin. Uh, he has a groin injury, so uh, he, 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 did, he came out of the game against the Giants. Uh, I expect him to have some problems with Trent Cole and his speed, but you know the Bills are going to try to run the, run the ball. If Peters leaves the game, then look out. You know that Jim Johnson will be coming from everywhere uh, because uh, uh, they will have protection problems as they try to uh, help somebody, help, help with Cole over there on the right side of the Eagles defense. But I expect the Eagles defense to play well. They need to come up with some turnovers. Uh, that will be the key. If they can get turnovers, they can put this game away early and uh, finish the season with three straight wins, which is what they're trying to do. But uh, I feel good about the Eagles and their defense. They should be able to play well in this game. Uh, the key will be turnovers. Uh, when you get opportunities, get interceptions or fumbles, come down with them.